Right, this is something of a random video. Um, basically, uh, you know when you start on MSN, some some random person always, always, always asks, "What are you up to?" And uh, for the past couple of days, my reply has been working on my golden demon entry. And they ask, "Oh, cool, what is it?" And because of what it is, it's uh, rather complicated to explain. So I thought I'd show you instead. That's what this video is for, is to show you what the hell my golden demon entry is. Enjoy! Right, what you're looking at now is uh, basically the whole of my golden demon entry. And yes, I did go out and buy a land raider, and I did build it, and I did break it. For some reason, I find some perverse kind of pleasure in spending that much money and then demolishing it. Um, yeah, basically, it's a battle scene uh, inspired by the shiny new Seasons of Death stuff. We've got Imperial Guard, he's not standing up right. There we go. Yep, Imperial Guard, supported by Space Marines. Uh, spin it around. All this bit here. All this will be barricaded with the new Season of Death stuff, but I don't have that kind of money at the moment because I'm poor. Um, spin around again. You can see Dozer Blade. I used a Dozer Blade that I had spare. I think it looks wonderful. Um, Dozer Blade. I've made it. Uh, I've tried to make it look as beat up as possible. Um, got a bit of explosion there. Bullet holes, you'll see a closer version in a minute. Uh, spin it around again. Plenty of old 40k ruins, which I hope will still be available because they just look so damn cool. Um, if you see street from the opposite way, this big hole in the land raider, maybe turn that around, you can see there is a big hole. There is a big hole in the top of the land raider. I'm debating whether to have that a flaming hatch or a jury rigged missile launcher either of which I think would look really cool uh, we've even got this thing here is in fact a ruined, mo ruined motorcycle it's in flames spin it around this bit here I'm thinking of using as some kind of ammo dump but if you can think of something that would look better or something that would be more accurate to a battle scene uh, then let me know and I'll consider it. This yellow piece of crap is, yes, it is styrofoam. Um, that's just basically so I can slap on Radiant Expeller and just make it into a big pile of rubble, basically. The ruin, other ruined side of the Land Raider, it's been looted and it's been patched up. Um, this wonderful gunky crap is. Uh, Ready break mixed with uh, PVA glue and water. Uh, doesn't look too appealing, but the end result is uh, rather nice. Yeah, and we do have a little squash dude who you'll see in just a second. That brings you back around to the front. Right, what you're looking at now is man's eye view of what is the main street bit of the whole scene and I just knocked a dude over. Never mind. Stand him up again. There we go. Um yeah we've got the Space Marines here. Veteran sergeant. Looks a bit tasty. We've got uh got Imperial Guard. We've got yeah, several Imperial Guard. And this bit here, that's the Land Raider. So turn it round. You can see a bit more. There's the auto cannon team with the auto cannon. This black blob here, believe it or not, is an apothecary kneeling over a wounded space marine, which took me ages to build, but looks damn cool anyway. Uh, this is a rock. It's a rock. Can you believe it? It's a rock. Actually, it's fool's gold, but I decided it didn't look too good on my mantelpiece, so I thought. Stick it in there, make good rubble. Now, like I said, all this is going to be filled in with, um, like, 
through to death, razor wire, slate, ruins, stuff like that. Uh, I actually used a chaos vehicle sort of ram thing to make this barricade, which I think looks a bit tasty. Then, a close up view, finally, of the damn cool dozer blade. I've beat it up as much as possible. Uh, I think there's a bit more I can do around here. Yeah, more battle damage around this sort of area. I've actually got a little explosion damage there, which took me ages to get just right. Uh, spin around it again. More ruins. We like ruins. There you can see one of the two mortar teams I have, but I need three. I would have three, uh, but I'm missing a bipod. If you don't know what a bipod is, it's this little triangular bit here. Yeah, that little triangular bit that holds the uh, mortar up. Spin it around yet again. We've got two Imperial Guardsmen running to the fight, and yes, the broken bike. The front bit's there, and the back bit is in flames. It is cotton wool at the moment, but when it's painted, it's going to look a bit smexy. Then you've got the polystyrene, or styrofoam, whatever the hell you want to call it, which is, yeah, it's yellow. We've got more, uh, more detailed view of the room side of the line radar. <gasps> Rocks. And you can just make him out there. The squished Imperial Guardsman. We got squished by Vady Breck and PDA glue. Lucky him. Uh, it will look more like rubble when I've painted it and textured it and stuff like that. So around, we've got a column uh, giving the land radio excuse to be so much on its side. And a wheel. We've got a wheel. Uh, I'll see if I can get a few more close up shots of cool things you haven't seen yet. Can you see Space Marine with a flamer? There he is. He will have flame coming all out here. It's got rather good. Uh, I've been practicing with uh, cotton wool and stuff like that, so it should look okay. Uh, yeah, can you just make him out? Apothecary, aiming bolt pistol, and there's the dying dude. I'm poking him. I don't know if you can see him. No, you can't. Uh, yeah, we've got the other mortar squad, which uh, didn't take me that long. Right, let's see if I can get you a few more close-ups. Right here, we've got a guy who got shot in the head and he's now slumped down on the ground, dead. I think he's going to look rather good when he's painted, because I like painting blood and stuff like that. Turn the camera a wee bit. You can just make it out of the box, dude. Cowering. Yeah, there we go. There's the apothecary and dying space marine. It will look a lot better when it's painted. You'll be able to see more detail too. Um, this is Land Raiders' last cannons. One of them is completely broken off. And the other one's bent, so there's no way of using it. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, that's pretty much that. Right, well that was my uh, Golden Demon uh, entry. Uh, I didn't glue the models down, I pinned them, that's why they fell over. Uh, so yeah, I've now got basically the whole thing set up. I need to buy a few more Space Marines, I need to buy a few more uh, Cadians. Then I need to take all the loose bits off, i.e. the men. Uh, I need to paint them, I need to paint the base, I need to texture the base. Uh, hopefully that rough coat spray won't screw up the actual board too much because that would really be a pain in the ass. Uh, I need to get some rubble, uh, cut up sprues, uh, stones, stuff like that. Um, yeah, it's far from finished, far from finished, but uh, I like it, I'm proud of it so far. Hopefully I don't do anything to nose it up because if I do I'll be pissed off basically uh yeah that's it see you around toodles